Hello friends. Today we're going to be cleaning my closet. This doesn't I thought I thought that would go more smoothly. Woof. We're cleaning my closet. Hi friends, I hate doing these photo booth intros because on my analytics it shows that people skip them but I filmed this first portion like a month ago of me actually cleaning out my closet but it's not as interesting as me sorting through it so I cut out a lot of it um but I wanted to keep it in because I introed it in here and I also like mentioned it in the other one so yeah you could just skip to the end um, I need to get rid of some stuff. So that's what it's gonna do. It's gonna do. That's what I'm gonna do. So some things aren't really my style anymore. And a lot of this stuff I haven't worn because it's a pandemic. So let's just get started. I think I'll start right here and I'll bring you. Come on, you guys, let's go. Hey, queen. We're just gonna start going through right here. Keeping this Brandy Melville sweater because they are just so comfortable. I used to wear this a lot. Oh, another sentimental memory is coming up. This is why, how do people, I always like, I pick up a clothing piece and I'm like, remember, remember when I wore, when that, I wore that, that, one that one time? time? <sighs> oh, yeah, I'm kind of over cardigans like the, like these. This is from the last time I went thrifting where we were maskless. Uh, so I never really got to wear it, but I'm kind of over cardigans. They just remind me of sitting at home. And then this, someone told me in the thrift haul of this that I looked good. Fortunately, I'm letting it go. Okay, first things first, we are ignoring any and all clutter. In my room, I tried to like get it out of frame, but like, you know, it's actually been almost a month since I filmed the first part. Now, this is a portion where I sort through the clothes. It's probably gonna be lots of you know what, let me just... What I'm going to do is I'm sorting stuff that I'm donating from stuff that I'm going to put on Depop. I'm doing this um, to show you like what's going to be on my Depop. However, these aren't going to be on my Depop like as soon as this goes up, especially because I'm literally going to try and edit this all today and post it tomorrow. Yeah, I'm probably going to have these up on my Depop in like a month and then I'm gonna do like a video on it. So anyways, let's just get started on sorting through everything. This is like the true closet clean out. I guess I should have done it like this. The first thing, this is going to be donated. I mean, unless someone wants it, like if you see something that you like, just comment or something. This is lots of noise. An Adidas windbreaker. This, I think it's gonna be donated. This is a little yellow slip dress. I don't know if I mentioned, I actually wear slip dresses to sleep. I used to be like, oh my God, and want to wear them out. But some of them like this one, I don't think it's wearable for me to wear out. I don't know. There was a time. This, I can't decide. I might put this on Depop. This I have gone back and forth with. It's a super Y2K dress and it kind of has this hibiscus print, which I saw is apparently in. And it's like a bandeau style. And then also there's a part of me that was like, I could like thr thrift flip this into like a mini skirt and a little tank top. And I actually think I might want to do that. These, I think I'm going to have to donate because they are, what's that word when it starts to collect that stuff? These I'm putting on Depop. But yeah, they're not really my style anymore. So for that reason, Depop. These are my black jeans. These are going on Depop. These are Urban Outfitters. They're actually really cute, like perfectly distressed, and I believe they came like that. Um, however, I don't really like the fit of them, and I never really did. The only reason I got them was because I used to have these Levi's that I thrifted that were like a little bit too big. And so these were supposed to be the replacement because I couldn't thrift any black jeans that I liked. Like I just couldn't find them. And I have that problem a lot where I don't want to get rid of clothes because I want to thrift their replacement and I never end up doing it. So I'm just going to get rid of this now so I can find its replacement. Also these, 
Ugh, these were one of my favorite thrifted items. I think it's finally time to let it go. I actually put these on my Depop over the summer, but I took them off because I like priced them really high because I wasn't sure if I wanted to let them go. This is just a little picnic dress kind of. It's kind of very 2017. That is the year that I got it. Wore this to my high school graduation. I don't know if I should Depop this or donate it. I'll have you decide. Should I Depop this or donate it? Do you guys think this would sell on Depop? I don't know. Maybe it will. This jean jacket, um, I think I'm gonna put on Depop. These pants and Depop, gingham, picnic. Oh, these 100% going on my Depop. These are Rocky Mountain jeans. These I think I'm gonna have to donate because they're super frayed. These cute Gap corduroy shorts. Ugh, I used to like wear those all the time. I also cut them myself, but corduroy like wears down. These, this is going on Depop. It's a Burberry skirt. If something is like designer at the thrift store and they don't mark it up, get it. Just resell it, like I don't care. I like, okay, I'm just gonna talk and like throw things and this way is my donate pile. This way is um, my Depop pile. I just don't have a, I know lots of people are like, oh my God, resellers, no. I've talked about this, I don't really care. Yeah, I just don't really have a problem with resellers, especially because thrift stores have so much stuff, you guys. They have so much stuff. You know that they throw stuff away because they have so much stuff coming in. And then so if I see something like that Burberry skirt at Goodwill for like regular price, because they do have their pink label. I don't know if that's what it's actually called, but the tag is pink when it's like designer high end. And so they raised the price. Like I saw this one beautiful jacket, it was $25. And so they didn't mark up that Burberry skirt and it's real. And so I was like, this is a steal, I'm gonna get it. And I got it and now I'm gonna sell it. Yeah, also my grandpa was a reseller. <laughs> oh, I don't know if I should sell this. This is another item I keep going back and forth on. This is this Brandy Melville seat. Brandy Melville also, I know y'all are gonna eat it up. Um, It's this like cropped hoodie. I wore it when I bleached my eyebrows for the first time and I was bleaching my brother's hair. So there's like this tiny, tiny discoloration. You can't even see it. I think I'm just gonna sell it because like it's not even practical. These pants also, oh my god, I love these pants. They have these cute little like um, bell sleeve almost flare at the end. So cute, however they are too big on me. And they are low rise. Um, and then this is going on Depop. Donating this Captain Marvel t-shirt that I got from Walmart before I went to see Avengers Endgame because I was like, I gotta show my support, my fave Avenger at the moment. So yeah, and she was in it for like five minutes, but she looked good. I wanna put these pants on Depop so bad. I know there's like a paint stain on them, but I think it adds character. Look at this. This beautiful Y2, oh, it's only right here. Beautiful Y2K low-rise jeans they're like i got them and i was like oh my god they literally did not fit and i want to put them on depop because i feel like they're trendy i was actually thinking of waiting until they were even trendier but i really don't know oh my god also there's this top right here that i'm I was gonna add to the pile look at this little top it's like a crochet top it's from zara super cute it's, I didn't get it at Zara, I thrifted it. I just never got around to wearing it because the straps aren't like adjustable. And I hate when straps aren't adjustable because I, you're just gonna have to excuse the ruckus. I don't have any time to waste. Um, Brandy Melville, I have to sell this. Them girls eat it up every time. I'm so happy that I used to shop at Brandy because now I can resell the stuff for exactly the price I got it for. There's a makeup stain on here I have to hand wash out. Oh, these Urban Outfitters orange pants, every time I try and get rid of them, I'm like, no, I'll keep them. They're so 60s. I think in my last closet clean out, I was like, no, actually I'll keep them. They're so 60s. But I wore them and I just, I didn't really feel, I mean, I felt the vibe, but I'm like, there's not really many ways to wear these. I got for that Halloween video 
and I thought since I was into mini skirts, I would really love it. And I do, I love how it's elastic waistband, but I just don't really like the pattern all too much. Then same with this red one. I thought I would love it. Then I remembered, I hate wearing red. My school uniform was red. My high school uniform was red and my elementary school uniform was red. I absolutely dread, like I dread the color. I hate it so much. Liz Claiborne. Oh, this would be cute to play golf. I think this is, Yes, this is Liz Claiborne's sport. Trying to like get over plaid skirts. Again, uniforms. Ugh. Especially cause like this past year or whatever people were like, oh, a schoolgirl skirt? I'm gonna wear a schoolgirl skirt. I should pair that with a schoolgirl skirt. And I was like, stop calling it that. I'm putting this on Depop. <laughs> I think I might put this on Depop. The vintage cottage curl girlies will eat this up, right? This I have to sew by hand because I don't want to sit at the machine. I have to sew this back up. I wore this on my 20th birthday. <laughs> this I have to, I have to donate these unfortunately. These were the coolest pants ever. These were like my summer pants. They're all crochet and they had a lining and I cut them, but I was so dumb and I didn't even think to cut them even. And so it looked really weird. This is the last item that I have here. I think I'm just gonna donate this. It's like an old, um, it's like a dad sweater, grandpa sweater. The tag says the men's store, just the men's store. Donating it. Oh, that's it, right? That is it, you guys. Uh, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you like and comment and subscribe for more content from me. I have been lacking. And then also I'm like, I'm doing way too many vlogs even though I'm vlogging this week. I have some fun, exciting content planned. If you are interested in any of these items, um, follow me on Depop and within the next month, they will probably be on there. And I'll see you in my next video, which will be a vlog. So if you hate those, sorry. I forgot that I used to do this. I have not filmed a sit down video in a long time.